What's up, everybody? It's me, JB, the ultimate writer from the Fight Bros podcast. Kilso, um, I'm sure a few of you are up, uh, up to the play with some major changes that have been announced to the unified rules of MMA. Uh, one of the changes is they're going to introduce penalties for fighters using uh, outstretched fingers when they're striking, which uh, obviously leads to a lot of eye pokes and, uh, and you know can also lead to finger injuries as well good news there that they're addressing that also no more loose fitting clothing for female MMA fighters which I'm um, not sure if that's an issue at the moment but uh, obviously wardrobe malfunctions can definitely play into it uh, another one is they've repealed the clavicle law so the clavicle collarbone can't be grabbing on that anymore I'm sorry you used to not be able to grab on it apparently now you're going to be able to grab it uh, so yeah it's a rule that uh, we actually weren't even aware of so uh, another one there and the big one for me at least is they have changed so that the three points of contact is no longer a thing um, especially if it's one hand so three points of contact counts if it's like knee foot foot but if it's knee foot and hand that is not going to count or if it's foot foot and hand it has to be two hands down so that's good news uh, people have been taking advantage of that rule for a very long time you know, for me it's, it's always been a case that they've been trying to skew it towards wrestlers because wrestlers are obviously the most equipped to take advantage of a rule like that but yeah good news uh, for anyone who 